Hey folks, this is Imran from AllAboutEnders.com and today is the first time I'm running a custom ROM on my ASUS tablet and um, this is the one called ASUS ICS Hydroponic by Sean Z Screams. A few videos back we did make a video on how to put his custom tweaks and now he has released a full stock based um, ROM which I have to say hands down is really smooth and it performs way better than the stock that I was running for the past month. So just a quick overview of what the ROM has. Um, it has been debloated a lot, so most of the ASUS apps have been removed. The only two that have been kept are File Manager right there and the ASUS SuperNote since most people tend to use those two apps. Other than that, I've restored all my stuff from Titanium Backup, no issues there. And um, it is fully rooted, so once you flash the um, ROM, you should still have your root from the previous time, such as the method I showed you through Clockworks Mod Recovery where you just flash the root sign.zip. Um, right now I'm just putting, I, I just put a Jelly Bean wallpaper but it does come with a customized um, wallpaper which looks really nice. I've lost it since I changed the wallpaper. I'm not too sure where to get it again. Most likely it's somewhere in the ROM. I'll have to go look for that. Just moving on to tweaks. So it does come with the base uh, tweaks that he has made from before. You get battery tweaks, GPU tweaks, kernel tweaks, Dalvik cache tweaks as well. Um, in terms of um, customization, it's fully deodexed with zip alignment. S voice has been added as well, but um, I'm, I'm not a big fan of that, so most likely I'll never use that. Um, it does have a Nexus 7 boot animation as well as Nexus 7 sounds. Um, in terms of brightness as well, the lowest brightness has been uh, raised. So instead of it being completely like close to pitch black, at least now you can see the device when it's in uh, lowest brightness mode. It also has included the Samsung text-to-speech and if we go to settings it should be there somewhere oh this difficult options it should be there somewhere in the settings uh, for text-to-speech but I'm not sure where exactly it is but um, okay there we go text-to-speech output and we have the Samsung version as well okay now um, it is also busy box so you can run uh, your custom scripts you can create your custom scripts it has the Sony Bravia engine which improves image quality and video quality and um, it also comes with a customized launcher which is, is called bulletproof uh, launcher since it is using the supercharged script by Zeppelin Lin Rocks which I really love his work and this includes it within the ROM itself as you can see it's really smooth I haven't noticed any glitching no random reboots I've been using this for like three days right now and uh, no reboots actually stock for me would reboot at least once a day and sometimes it would just completely shut off and I'd had to boot it up again and yeah that's roughly it for this release um, there's a base ROM which you'll need to flash first and then flash the 3.5 update which is the this version hydro 3.5 this can only be flashed on top of a stock ROM so do not flash this if you've already used CM9 or AOKP flash first um, the stock image that has uh, I believe somewhere in the thread on XDA you should be able to find the stock ROM you flash the stock ROM first then you can flash the base ROM followed by the 3.5 update and there's no wipe needed from the base ROM to the 3.5 update and um, just to end off I'll show you guys the boot animation actually let me go straight to an app that can do a quick reboot so we don't waste too much time okay reboot here quick reboot and we'll go straight to the boot animation so this is the Nexus 7 boot animation that is used in this ROM. I hope you liked the video. This was Imran from AllAboutAndroids.com. Please do comment and subscribe. It helps us out. Please do like our Facebook page, our Google Plus account, and Twitter. Thanks.